what's up, my damies? MMTJ here. And Skinny Folks. Back on the attack with the Black Star Commentary GTA 5 Letter Piece Hunt. Let's get going, Let's shall we? Let's get it, shall we? Ooh. Now, as you can see, I'm back in my formal attire. And he's sexy. Oh, yes. I am a sexy beast. Look at this. You cannot resist. And top it off with a pickup truck. Oh, yeah. You know Look what at he's this. picking up? Look at that upskirt. You can't oh, handle on. that joke. Look at that. Oh, look at that, look at that. <laughs> he scratches us like, yeah, you can't handle that. But the boots make it. To get back on track, sorry we've been on hiatus. Things been going on. I've been getting stuff for PS Vita. And I have been busy in general. But you don't want to hear about that. You want to hear what's exciting in our lives. So we're going to get to that as soon as I read off the location of the next Letter piece. You, nah. you see, I'm saying letter piece now instead you of could have read piece. off that letter piece sooner, whatever. You know what? We don't have a script here. We ad lib, and that's what makes us great. We BS. Uh, we BS it to we death. We BS it to death. Oh. All right, number nineteen. Continuing on. As soon as my phone unfreezes. <laughs> The power of technology. Come on. There we go. All right, number 19. Make your way. Oh. They went through the trouble to detail rust. Now, that's attention to detail. They went through detail. Well, to animate that. They like went through that. a lot of detail to get the water right. They wanted to be sure that this game looked good. They cared. They pushed the PS3 to the limit. Hell, yeah. This is the game that pushes it to its limits. No Except other game. when you go back there where it goes up and down and everything's, like, freaking out. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's not perfect, like but... Like, the straight lines are kind of jumping all over the place. It's not perfect at points, but you can tell that Rockstar and the developers, the other developers that worked on this game, really tried their best to be sure that... That's because Rockstar's fucking rich. Shit, they tried their best to be sure that, okay, we're going to make this game look good. We aren't going to half-ass it. Like, everything Rockstar touches turn to gold. It turns to rocks. <laughs> <laughs> it turns to rocks. All right, <laughs> number 19. Make your way to this small winding road and make your way south along it from Route 68. When you get to the first curve in the road, stop and get out your car. In the side of the rock face, there will be a wooden floor. Bless you, by the way. Bless you, by the way. Thanks. Depending on where you're standing, though, it can be blocked by trees. Look for the wooden door, and the scrap will be on the ground to the left. So, now that I've read it, let's mark it on the map. Oh, no, man. he's he's getting ready. He's getting ready to, uh, he's he's getting getting ready ready. to mount. He's getting ready to mount the truck. He's one of those object sexuals. Oh uh, yeah, he's like, I'm gonna fuck this truck. <laughs> and then when I find that when I find that letter piece, guess what? I'm gonna fuck that. <laughs> I'm gonna fuck that. Uh, then I'm gonna give it to the police. And then I'm gonna fuck them. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing in this world is gonna go unfucked. <laughs> Oh, man, object sexuals. You already know about that chick that married the bridge and had a honeymoon with yeah, it. Yeah, I think we talked about that in the last um, No, we piece. talked about that off camera. We never talked about that on camera. Oh, for real? No, we never talked about that on camera, so we're talking about it now on camera. Yeah. Some crazy woman married a bridge so she can um, dry fuck hump it. it. <laughs> it's more dry humping than fucking. She wanted to fuck it. Uh, she wanted to fuck it. You may say dry hump, but in her mind, she was like, yeah, this bridge is going to give me some mad hard dick. <laughs> it's going to break me off. She is going to bridge me. <laughs> oh. 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 Okay. Hmm. Oh, wait a minute. Now I know why I can see it better. Because it wasn't turned to the side on my phone to make the map bigger. Ha, <laughs> ah, baka, 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 baka. Oh, but you just made me think of Waka Flocka. And I don't know what that is, but it sounds disappointing. What, Baka? <laughs> no, Waka Flocka. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. Where is it? Okay. Time for me to look for other shit. Well, we're still in North Blaine County. We are looking at a map. We are looking at the map indeed. Come on. Yes, this is something that you guys have been missing. Extreme we gameplay. Extreme <laughs> map finding shit. <laughs> oh, everyone missed us looking at maps. Look at this boss ass gameplay right here. You will not find any other content from any other YouTuber like this. You know, most YouTubers that are doing this probably like 
compiled all the location, like them just find, uh, showing where it is and finding. Well, you know what? We're not them, and they're not us. We do shit our way on Black Star Commentary. Yep, 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 yep. Shit, for all we know, this could be. Are the you right there? You're concentrating pretty hard. I'm trying you to need f- help. Um, no, I got this. All right. I don't need any help. Cause you're just sitting there zooming in, zooming out, looking up, looking down. <laughs> He's feverishly trying to find where this thing is. Yes. Yes. I- oh, shit. It's right there. The thing that looks like a sock. It's right on the tip of this. <laughs> yes. You might as well get it out of you. You already etched yourself, so you might as well just shoot. <laughs> no. No. All right. Now, I have marked it on a map. So... Let the journey begin. Da, 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 I don't know what you're saying. Da, 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 Are you trying to do Uncharted? Ah, oh, God, you're, da, terrible, you're butchering it. Da, 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 oh, for the Lord. For Pete's da, da, sake. Da, da, come on, you know you want to sing along. Da, 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 oh, shit. Da, 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 oh, da, please. Da, da, no more. Da, 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 Ryan. Da, 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 Ryan. Da, da, da. What does Ryan have to do with this? <laughs> <laughs> just the death of Carl when he died. It sounded like you were just saying that just to get me to shut up. Ryan, are you alright? Alright, so. Ryan! Ryan. <laughs> so there have been a few new things that have happened since we last recorded this. Number one, Skinny cut his hair. Nobody knew. Yes, Skinny used to have long hair for years. And when I met him in high school, he still had long hair. And even after that, he still had long hair. (laughs) So it was really surprising when he called me over to his house one day off of something that sounded like an emergency. It was like, I need you you to come over now. It was an emergency. I was like, something happened. You got to see this shit. It's sick. Shit, you kind of had me worried. But at the same time, I was thinking, if it was really that serious, you would have called and sounded really frantic. So I just continued getting my son chips from Aldi. <laughs> <laughs> I like, got to you know, love that Aldi. It was like, you know what? He could be dying or his kids could be dying, but I got to have those sun chips. I got to have those sun chips. So I come over and Skinny's hair is completely chopped off. As a matter of fact, tomorrow I gotta um go get it recut or evened out or whatever. Really? Yeah, it's been two weeks. Really? Yeah. Wow, that was a quick two weeks. Yeah. Damn. Time flies when you're an adult and you have to pay bills. <laughs> yeah. Well, I will formally welcome you to the short hair club for men. The fade club. Yeah. So, how are you liking your new dude thus far? Tell the folks. Meh. What made you decide to cut your hair anyways? Meh, I'm lazy. I got wow. tired of getting the braids, honestly. Oh, really? Yeah. You didn't like your long, flowing locks? No, it's really like... I guess it's one of those grass is the green on the other side thing. Mm-hmm. Uh, some people want longer hair because they think it'll make them more attractive or whatever. Yeah. But it also comes with its own set of burdens. Yeah. Just like uh, having your hair cut. You know, you gotta get it, uh, maintain, keep it maintained. So, in your opinion, maintaining short hair is a lot easier than maintaining long hair. Yes. Like, um, bit of, it's a bit embarrassing. Like, um, case in point, when I first cut my hair, I had dandruff. And, it, you know, it it didn't take long, like, once I cut it to get rid of it. But at the same time, it's Shit! Like, oh, my God. Please don't let me die. You're dead. What the fuck, man? Instant death! Damn it! <laughs> fuck! But, yeah, like... Like, my hair was so long, I couldn't get to my scalp to wash it. So, you know, it just, like, little things. Damn it, I was trying to make this a deathless run. And it doesn't, nec- just because you have long, flowing locks doesn't get you to bitches. Or does it? Or does it? Well, it depends on how tight your game is. Hair is just an accessory. Uh, hair is part of your body, but whatever. Well, <laughs> how can you say that's an accessory, an accessory to game. Like, some people think, like you said, long hair will get them bitches. Fuck off. Like, damn yeah, it. I like, wanted to keep the damn dress. Whatever. That dress is always going to be short-lived. That dress is bad luck. <laughs> Why are you running people over? Because I'm pissed that I lost my fucking dress. <laughs> I wanted to make this a deathless run, and so much for that shit. So Boy, I might as well just go back. Frail. She Somebody's, just fell over. So I might as well just 
just steal somebody's fucking Jeep and go back. I was fucking close too. Whatever. Okay, steal the damn car. How long does it take to steal the car? He's uh, doing stuff. Holy shit! I wonder if this is the truck I'm looking for because that's a side mission where I have to steal pills and I have to j hijack a truck. Nah, I don't think that's it. Even though somebody's probably looking at this and saying that's totally it, dude, and you missed your chance. I doubt that's going to happen. Yeah, we don't get comments on the regular. <laughs> well, I'm not going that way because the police are that way, so I'm going to go this way. Mm. Mm. It's funny. Somebody called the popo quick. Look, somebody's still in the Jeep. Get them. And the popo gave up quick. Oh, they aren't giving up. When, the, when that star disappears, then they'll give up. My bad. Right of the way, asshole. But yeah. Yeah, um, they gave up. No, but, the stars are on screen. But yeah, like full, if um, your full game ga sucks with without hair, it'll still suck without with hair. Yeah, plain and simple. It's, it's like a thing where, even though your chances are better, if you have a lot of money. That's with anything. That's if you have a lot of are... money and your game is bad, you just be like, "Fuck it, here's ten thousand dollars, suck my dick." But can't you just use that for anything in life? Like, hey, man, my YouTube channel is failing. Here, YouTube, here's a bunch of money. Suck my dick and promote, promote my the dick. shit out of my video. <laughs> then you're instant success. <laughs> but still, suck my dick, though. I want that. I want YouTube, I want YouTube to suck my dick. I want all of you to suck my dick. I want every subscriber out there unsubscribe to me and suck my dick and then subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> every person unsubscribe to suck your dick and then subscribe. Mm -hmm. In order to subscribe to Black Star Commentary, you got to suck our dicks. <laughs> That's so terrible. <laughs> You're an asshole. <laughs> you see, I'm willing to get my dick sucked, but I'm, I'm not willing to get. I'm willing to get my dick sucked, but I'm not willing to suck dick to get to the top. He's like, you're like. I'm doing a favor for you yes. by letting you suck my dick. It is a privilege. <laughs> it is a uh. fucking privilege that you're even honored. You sound like the type of woman I hate. <laughs> <laughs> it is a privilege that you are even getting the distinct pleasure to fuck me. You should be happy that you get to fuck this pussy. <laughs> yeah, whatever. <laughs> and back to this point where I died. Now, if this is Dark Souls, you would see a replay of me just rolling off the edge of that cliff. <laughs> <laughs> oh, have you saw any of those when you were playing? What? Um, of people just dying? Yeah, like you saw any blood stains when you were playing Dark Souls? I've seen some blood stains. Awesome. Some of them were kind of hilarious. Some were like, oh, that was kind of obvious. You shouldn't have done that. But I can't say shit because some things I've done, I shouldn't have done. Have you even beat the, the first boss yet? No, because the game fucking cheated me. You heard my story. Yeah, but pick it up and play again. I will, just not now. Whatever. You fucking casual. Shit. I'm not gonna lie though. Uh, there it is. I was in a, a stream the other day. Well, not the other day, but all right, guys. Time back. Pay attention because this is where the scrap is. And I made a joke like we were talking about casuals and stuff, and then I was like, "Yeah, my friend's been stuck on Taurus Deer for two weeks." Yes, way to talk shit about me. <laughs> way to talk shit about me. I'm glad that and you we, care enough we, to let people know how shit I am at Dark Souls. Nobody even knows who you are. Well, they will now when they see this because they're gonna put two and two together and be like, "Oh shit, that's the guy that's a fucking noob at Dark Souls who can't even beat the first boss." <laughs> <laughs> it's just it's just hilarious like you're stuck on Taurus. Oh, uh, that's because I'm having bad runs. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> it's like that was the closest I've got until the fucking game just cheated the shit out of me by making me fucking just fly, fly. off the <laughs> theater, fly off the damn castle when I went for the damn dive stab. Shit. Who wouldn't be pissed when that shit happened? That's why I've been playing the game since then. <laughs> So you rage quit it. I rage quit the fuck out of that game when that shit happened, man. <laughs> I'm sorry. I was not gonna... My, my runs after that were gonna be shit. Oh, man. Oh, and I say a lot. You were so heated. Ooh! Oh, my God. It was like... I, I told you I almost broke that copy. The copy of Dark Souls that I have is not my copy. That skinny's copy that he lent to me. I almost broke that thing. But I have to remember. my game. I have to remember it's not my game. Shit. Don't break my stuff because you bad at video games. Yeah, fuck, I'm only bad at that game. I'm good at everything else. No, you're not. <laughs> you're not. 
All right, we found number 19. Let's move on to number 20. When you, this is a short one. When you reach this farmhouse located just south of, just southeast of Harmony, look behind the billboards to find the scrap. I think Skyrim might be more your type of game. Maybe. <laughs> it's, so, it's so easy. Even my brain dead niece can do it. So you're saying I'm, I'm not better than a brain dead child? No. Thank you. I'm glad that you care about me. So let me know how good I am. <laughs> how much faith you have in me. Uh, but fortunately, I don't have a brain dead niece. So that's, yeah, that's cause a flat out lie. That would be fucked up if you just put that out there. <laughs> I would call you a monster. Nah, I remember I, I kind of ripped that from Family Guy. Mm. Oh, my half retarded niece went to Brown. <laughs> oh, I didn't see that. I didn't see that episode of Family when Guy. When Brian was telling all the Ivy League dickheads was, where what his school he went to. Was that new Family Guy? No, that's the whole Family Guy. Okay, the old. good Family Guy. It's just it was it was one of those subtle jokes that kind of flew by. Yeah. Okay, it's down here. All right, it should be up in this little pocket. Yeah, pocket time. On to number two. Whoa, hold on. Hold on. I need to be sure I get the number right. On to number 20. 21. No, oh, 20. 20, finally. 20. It took us a long time to get here, but we got to 20. Hell yeah, but the journey has been nothing less than entertaining. And we're going to, and this is where our journey ends, my friend. Oh, where, where did that come from? Oh yeah, fucking um, fucking heavy rain. Not heavy rain. Um, damn it, what's that other shitty David Indigo Cain game? Prophecy. Indigo Prophecy. And, and this that's is where how my, my story is. ends. Yeah, game over. Game over, man. But yeah, lately I've just been playing. Uh, I played the shit out of Dark Souls and Dark Souls Two, and got so burnt out of it. Yeah. I started playing other games, and now I'm interested in getting. Borderlands 2 for my Vita because I've, I've been tired of the console, console, period. Yeah. So I might just uh, get Borderlands 2 for my Vita. I thought about getting Borderlands 2 for the Vita, but nah. Then you stop thinking about it? Nah, because I'm not sure what kind of gimmicks they'll put on to the Vita that were already perfect with the console version. There aren't any gimmicks. You know that for a fact? Yeah. I mean, like, Switch gimmicks? Yes. Like any button gimmicks like they had a fucking Golden Abyss? No, none of that. Golden Abyss was fucking retarded with the touchscreen gimmick. Like, no. They no, that whole, the final boss I was about because to say, of that. Spoilers, your final boss fight in Golden Abyss is, is a swipe fight. Exactly, it's you constantly swiping the screen. And throwing punches via <laughs> swiping the screen. Swipe diagonal, swipe in a zigzag, that swipe is a, in a circle. That is a perfect <laughs> example of how to execute a final boss fight in an Uncharted game. That was the worst. That No, what are you talking about? That was great. It was awesome. It was great, man. <laughs> what are you talking about? What am I talking about? Did you know that you have a skeleton in your body right now? I know that. <laughs> but I'm glad to know <laughs> that somebody else knows that other than me. <laughs> That's how great that final boss fight was. Shit. It knew it had a skeleton in its body. Oh, oh man. man. Golden Abyss wasn't terrible. It wasn't terrible. It was but... just that... that the touchscreen gimmick. The touchscreen and that fucking gimmicks. gyro. That gyro balancing shit the, killed me more times than anything in that game. Just like there's only like five games on a PlayStation 3 that uses that six axis shit, which yeah. is basically the gyro shit. That's yeah, what it's called, you know how six you know how, how hype how much they hype that shit up. Like, like guess you what? turn your controller and it can turn. control shit. It, your character turns as you turn Guess your what? It's the most underused feature in the PS3 so far. <laughs> <laughs> Only five games use that. Mm-hmm. Oh, man. Like, I'm a purist. I'd rather just go ahead and use analog sticks. The shit I've been using for years. But you know what's crazy? Um, something simple. That It's a simple accessory you should get for your Vita. Um, the, 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 the PlayStation Vita hand grips. Yeah. It, it, it makes it feel so much better. There it is. Here's the next scrap, people. Ding, 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 ding. Like, I, you can pull, you can literally play for hours without... You know how if you play for a long time on a Vita... Your hands it, get sweaty? Yeah, and it'll feel like it hurts your hands a little yeah. bit. Yeah. Yeah, like it'll crump your hand. I got, not with that hand grip. I got that a lot when I was playing 
Ninja Gaiden. Because at certain points in that game, it gets so intense. I'm just in it, and my hands start sweating, and my my hands kind of like slip off of there, yeah. slip off slip off the Vita. So that sounded like that would be a good investment. I actually thought about getting like one of those carrying cases, but oh, yeah. I don't carry my Vita as much as I used to. Yeah, I don't take my Vita everywhere. It's just when my kids are watching TV. Yeah, yeah, I'm looking at it now. It looks actually Here, looks pretty good. Check it out. Feel it. Fuck! Feel it. I just dropped my phone. Feel that shit. Oh, this feels so good. I'm glad you let me touch it. Oh yeah. Oh man. Ugh. I'm never gonna let this go. Don't. No, I'm not gonna <laughs> let it go. No, I'm gonna hold it. Palm it. Like, I'm <laughs> gonna yeah. caress it. But yeah, in all honesty, yeah, that seems like a very good um. It's like very good bucks, but it's totally worth. That's it. a good accessory. I might get that. Uh, yeah. Fifteen bucks, shit. Yeah, and then like, it changes your finger placement to where you're not always touching the back thing of the screen. Yeah. And it makes it a little bit easier to touch the rear touchpad. All right, all right, guys. Number twenty-one. Oh, that was my shameless plug. Yes, we're Sony pl- sponsor me. Oh man, Aquafina, sp- no, <laughs> not Aqu- Dasani sponsor me. I fucking love your water. I would, I would sell the shit out of that. Yeah, but yeah, Dasani sponsors Blackstar commentary. <laughs> Oh, by the way, before we reach this next letter piece, I'd like to go ahead and put a special word in from the sunny, the, sunny. the sparkly, clean, clean, crisp water that tastes like you just got it from a mountain spring. The sunny, it's delicious. <laughs> the sunny is delicious. All right, back to oh. the regularly scheduled program. Number twenty-one. When you reach the construction site here, go to the northwest side to see a large cylinder being built behind orange fencing in the center of the circular floor. Floor. There will be an opening with a scrap inside it. Got it. Now let me find it on the map. Have you found it? Uh, it takes a while to scroll back to the top of this page. <laughs> Bear with me here. It's okay. Take your time. Almost. Almost. Okay. Oh, wow. It's right up in here. Right all up in that. Oh, yeah. Get a little bit on up in there. Yeah, I right, should be cool. up in this little area. It's not really too clear on the map, but this is the general. Oh, not far. Cool. All right. On to the next letter piece. Letter piece. Oh, we haven't said that in a while. It feels foreign. Yeah, it feels so good to say it again. Yes, it feels so good. Oh, let it be. Oh, it feels so good to let that out. Let it out. Okay, don't get too... Too retarded with that. Let it out there. <laughs> Why, wow, it shows how much interest you have in the fucking letter hunt when you're playing your Vita game <laughs> while we're trying to do this. <laughs> what are you talking about? I'm Dude. having coherent conversation. Dude, turn you. that shit off and focus on the commentary. All right, there. I turned it off. Yeah. <laughs> when I say turn it off, I mean to turn it all the way off. I was just testing some. Dude, if you do not turn it off, I swear I will get naked right now. <laughs> Don't do that. Then turn it off. Do you hate me? Yes, I do. Oh, okay. Because you're not paying attention. Okay. How about this? I'll turn it off first after you. I ain't turn the shit off. I can never turn this off. <laughs> <laughs> it is on always. All right. Uh-oh. Turn it down. Because I forgot that the thing was kind of turned up, so it might bleed into the sound. It's not that loud, dude. I think it is that loud. You don't know. I hear it. I hear it too. I hear it and it might bleed. It's not going It's going to fucking bleed, man. Just turn it off, please. You're being a you're being a nerd. No, I'm not being a nerd. I'm being professional. It's a difference. No, you're not being professional. Because if you're being professional, you wouldn't mention it in the video. Oh, I'm going to mention it in the video. <laughs> because you gave me no choice because you won't listen to your master. Well, now I really ain't turning it down. You know what? <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> nah. Hope you drop that and that thing breaks. <laughs> I hope I don't. Nah. My hope counters your hope. No. Because I count as five people. Fuck that shit. <laughs> you can count as one. I hated that shit when somebody did that. Oh, shit. It's right there. Oh. Look, look, look how... That's a piece of paper. Now, if that shit would have just fell in, we would have been fucked. <laughs> it really would have been, like, so much for your murder investigation. I like how all these pieces of paper are just sitting here undisturbed. And there are clear changes in the weather in this game. But it doesn't affect where these things are. 
Like they don't blow around. Like no, they are they are super glued to the earth until you find them. So where's the next uh, letter piece? Well, let me look at the map and find out, shall we? Letter piece. Yes. But yeah. Okay. Okay. Borderlands 2 Vita, I've been getting mixed reviews. Mm-hmm. And then this one guy, well, this guy at GameStop was like, there was a couple of people who were like, IGM bashed the shit out of this game. Borderlands? Yeah. For the Vita? Yeah, they bought, they bought, <clears throat> but then they was like, uh, IGN is biased against Vita games, period, though. Mm, that's You see, that's why they're called Internet like, Gaming News and not Internet Gaming Reviews. Like they gave Borderlands 2 on the Vita like a 5. Hold on, hold on. We'll, we'll, we'll continue that after I read the next piece. Number 22. Just north of the power station along the eastern beach, there's a rather large cave that you can enter from the water. Inside will be a boat in the scrap you want you want on the left side. You'll need to go all the way into the cave to see it. So we're going to go spelunking. Time to go in and get a, uh, time a boat. To, time to go in this deep, dark cave. Ooh. Ooh, hell There's yeah. There's nothing about that sentence I don't like. Oh, <laughs> God. You were telling me, man. <laughs> You don't know I'm how much that you turns didn't get me back on. In your car. I am. I gotta run around because for some reason I can't climb over this. Oh, let me shut up because I can just climb over that. Yeah, yeah. It doesn't make sense if you couldn't climb over that because you climbed over that to get in there. I did. Yeah. I don't remember that. I have to watch this back. You literally like oh, walked shit. right over it. I am. I am looking before I leap. No, I'm actually leaping before I look because I don't know where I'm going. Number twenty-two. Twenty. Oh, whatever. Dos dos. I don't know what 22 is in Spanish. Vente dos. I'm glad one of us knows that. That, that shows you how much attention I was paying in Spanish class. Or Whoa! Is look how far it is. or vente? Somebody vente. will correct us. I'm pretty sure That is. Vente. Wow, we are kind of far from that. Damn, it's like way down here on the beach. I think this is a part we haven't even discovered yet. No, it's well, not. Well, it's... Clearly covered by the fog of war. So, yeah. It's clearly covered by that fog that eats people. <laughs> yeah, you know. Holy shit. Holy shit, that takes you off road. Oh, well, good thing we have this faux jeep. Yeah. This feep. <laughs> You're going off road, G. 